Hello everyone and thanks for hanging out with me. Today a new update for the WeConnect ID app for Android was released and I think the same one was released a few weeks ago for uh, for iOS and it looks pretty good. First of all it's in dark mode as you can see and uh, but all, some people already said for them it's not dark and I don't know if this has to do with the settings in the system that your main uh, system has to be in dark mode I don't know what I can see is that now you can change the temperature uh, but it doesn't start preheating that's amazing and it shows start charging even though I'm not plugged in. That was not happening uh, before. But the main thing for me, and this is what iOS had for a few weeks, is that it now shows, first of all, I called it now Walter, has to be, but now it shows my real car, white, with my rims, first edition. This is exactly my car, first edition plus. And when you go into climate, it looks a bit different now. It's still synchronizing because I changed the temperature, but it's good that it doesn't preheat right away. That's really good. Also nice uh, is now the few here for your preheating, preconditioning uh, uh, plan. And underneath there would be a charging plan if you have that. And I have to try if it works now. I haven't done it yet. And in settings, you now have uh, uh, the name of your car. You have the, the same settings, except the only thing that's new is the two zone. You can now switch that off, but could, you could do that before so it doesn't warm up the, the, the passenger seat. I don't know if this is working because it was there before in the climate. You can click the seat, but then uh, it, it would do that. And other than that, it's the same thing. You still see your uh, uh, charging and everything, which is not in dark mode for, for whatever reason. Um, just a short video, wanted to show you that because it looks good and I love that now it's showing my actual car. That's awesome. Thank you much for watching. Have a great day and take care. Bye.